story of a young Dutchman. Through his veins surged the blood of a seafaring ancestry. In his heart, there dwelt a desire to voyage to distant countries, a deep-rooted urge to journey across land and sea to faraway horizons. In all his youthful dreams, young Van der Decken pictured himself as the figure he so ardently desired to be. A miracle? No. Just a young man's daydream. A dream so powerful, so intensively experienced, he really believes himself transformed. He is a captain, the pilot of a giant airliner in which he will sail the skies. Flight check. Completed. Ground power? On. Oil cooler doors? Automatic. Cowl flaps? 22 degrees and automatic. Degrees. Controls. Three. Let's keep our tower from Papa Papa Whiskey ready for takeoff. Destination Lisbon. Let's keep our tower from Papa Papa Whiskey. Papa Papa Whiskey is airborne zero three. Change over Coca Whiskey. someone of that name? Van der Decken is the name of a legendary Dutch merchant captain, better known as the Flying Dutchman. According to the story, he's been sailing the seven seas for hundreds of years. Richard Wagner used his story as a theme for his opera. Don't you remember?
know my name. Sit down, stranger, and drink with me. You're the first living man I've met for 300 years. Come on, sit down, man. I'm Captain Van der Decker, known all over the Seven Seas as the Flying Dutchman. And who may you be? My name also is Van der Decker. What? You're a Van der Decker? Where from? From Amsterdam. Well, hell's bells, man. Then you must be one of the family. You know, sailing the Seven Seas for centuries is all very well. But you get a little homesick in the end. How are things in the old home port? Amsterdam's all right, thank you. By the way, how did you get here? I came on my ship. Why, bless me, a sailor. Blood will tell. Oh. Well, not a sailor exactly, but I'm a captain, all right. A captain? At your age? You drink this. Sorry, I'm not allowed to drink on duty. <laughs> That's a good one. A captain who doesn't drink. What are these newfangled ships I see about nowadays? No masts, no sails, no nothing. And the crew, are they still the same mutinous rascals? Oh, no. They're highly trained specialists, every one of them. Modern flying is a science, you know. Flying? Who's talking about flying? Are you trying to make a fool of me? No, oh, no, of course not. I'll fly you wherever you say. Where do you want to go? Egypt? Greece? Africa? Could you make it Amsterdam? I'll take you on a special flight to Amsterdam, if you like. It's only four hours flying from here. And now this is my ship. Why, hell's bells. That's one of those creatures I've seen sailing over my head. I always thought they were some sort of a bird. Well, in a way they are. They're called after you, too. Look, the Flying Dutchman. Bless my soul. Hello, boys. We've got a VIP today. I would like to introduce you all to... Oh, please, Captain Von der Decken, do show up. The Flying Dutchman, Captain Von der Decken. Mr. Witt, my co-pilot. Mr. Harms, the flight engineer. Mr. Duncan, the navigator. Mr. Lummins, the radio operator. And this is Miss Lenkamp, to whom I should have introduced you first of all. How do you do, Miss? Are you coming along too? Of course. I'm your stewardess. Stewardess? Hmm. Times have suddenly changed. This is the cabin for the passengers. I'll have to leave you now, but I'll be back when we've taken off. Up, pop up a whiskey, 17,000 feet clear to go. Captain, he's gone. Oh no, he's just made himself invisible again. You take over, okay. I'll get Granddad. Come on, Grandad, no nonsense now. Where are you? I'm right here. Come up on the bridge. Quick. I'll show you how this ship is flown. Now, this is the compass. Hell's bell. Yes, I know you've got one too, but now let me show you something you haven't got. Here, look through this glass play with these knobs, and in two minutes we know our position, even in the middle of the Atlantic. Some plotting, eh, Captain? Hell's bells. See, this little clock shows us our altitude. We're now cruising at 17,000 feet. And see him talking? He's our radio operator, constantly in touch with the people on the ground. And this shows us our speed. 
It's your 10 knots against our 300 miles an hour, Captain. Hell bell. We're over Amsterdam now. My good old Amsterdam. Skip old tar from Papa Papa Whiskey, cleared to land. show you Amsterdam. But don't look for the horses, because there aren't any. A lot has changed in the world since your time, but some things have remained the same. The beauty of Amsterdam, for instance. The canals, the old merchant houses. Oh, by the way, these illuminations are not especially in your honor. They're made to please all our guests from abroad. You see, we of Amsterdam are still quite proud of our city. Well, that was Amsterdam. Would you like to stay? Yes, very much, my boy. It's been a wonderful experience. But I have to go back to the sea where I belong. Hey, you! Wake up! Daydreaming again, were you? was just a fantasy, a dream of so many young people of today, inspired by an ardent desire to fly out beyond faraway horizons, to blaze a glorious trail along the skyways of civil aviation.